That time, AJ Burnett completely shattered the window of a truck while warming up, shattering the truck's window and giving Billy the scare of the century. Two. Steve Lyons forgets there is a crowd watching, drops his pants. Steve Lyons accidentally pulls down his own pants after beating out a bun single in the top of the fifth. Omar Quintanilla's short fly ball to left center is caught by BJ Upton, but not before he bumps into his brother, Justin. Four. Shane Victorino crashes into the right field wall while pursuing Emilio Bonifacio's two-run homer, crumpling in pain but staying in checkout. In a spring training game in March 24, 2001, a dove flew by home plate and was hit by Johnson's screaming fastball, causing an explosion. Six. Sometimes, foul balls can be fun to catch, but they can also hurt. Fortunately, on Sunday night, a foul ball off the bat of Adam Jones pictured here didn't hurt anyone, but it did some big damage to a television camera lens. Seven. It's the ultimate heroic moment. A few years ago, we all saw the video in which Tampa Bay Rays third baseman and all-star Evan Longoria does what amounts to saving someone's life when he barehands a fly ball heading directly towards ESPN's Kenny Main from one of his race teammates during batting. White Sox minor league outfielder Rodney McRae makes an improbable catch, crashing through the outfield fence in Portland. Aaron Judge destroys Dodgers bull Pandor while making catch. Aaron Judge catches a fly ball by Los Angeles Dodgers designated hitter J.D. Martinez in the eighth inning at Dodger Stadium on Sunday. The catch sent him to the 10-day injured list with a right big toe injury. Ten. An Atlanta Braves fan learned never to celebrate until the deed is done. A fan trying to beat the freeze in the beloved Atlanta Braves mid-inning race tumbled to the dirt while leading his competition during Thursday's game against the Arizona Diamondbacks. Turner Ward makes the leaping catch, with his momentum taking him through the outfield wall checkout. It's very dangerous. Who put that stupid wall there? Carl Crawford chases down a fly ball in foul ground and makes a sensational reaching grab that causes him to tumble into the stands. Elliot Johnson falls into a dugout while going for foul ball. Elliot Johnson makes a tremendous effort chasing a foul pop, sending him flying into the Phillies dugout in the sixth inning. Frazier chases foul, almost flips into dugout. Todd Frazier almost flips over the railing and into the Padres dugout while chasing a foul ball, but Brooks Conrad makes the save. Gardner destroys recycling bin with bat. Brett Gardner takes out his frustration on the recycling bin in the Yankees' dugout after striking out. MLB Cameraman Fail Game 4 ALDS Rays vs Rangers Adrian Beltre hits a solo home run and as he's headed to home, the camera tries to get a sweet angle and just eats the turf. So awesome. Photographer gets hit with ceremonial first pitch. 
A White Sox employee threw out the first pitch before Tuesday's game and ended up beaning a cameraman who was standing off to the side of the mound. The moment immediately became a candidate for worst first pitch ever. A fan takes a tumble while attempting to make a nice catch on Matt Joyce's foul ball in the top of the eighth. Baseball fan drops little girl for foul ball. Caught on tape. A baseball fan in Taiwan picking up the little girl he dropped when lunging to try to catch a foul ball. Kevin Kiermeyer fouls a ball straight into his jungle buttons. Remember, a fastball travels at speeds of over 100 miles per hour. Imagine receiving one to a man's most sensitive area. After breaking his bat on a ground out, Carlos Gomez falls down the steps as he returns to the dugout. Incredible catch! Manuel Margot makes crazy grab to get Rays out of inning. Manuel Margot made one of the greatest catches you will ever see in a postseason game, leaning over the rail to make the grab to end the Astros inning. The Rays OF went all out. Jay Buhner leaps and tumbles over the fence to rob a home run. Jay Bunner leaps and tumbles over the fence to rob a home run. Jay Bunner leaps to rob Scott Hatterberg of a homer and falls over the wall and into the bullpen. Villar slides into Phillips' backside. Jonathan Villar tries to stretch for a double but is thrown out while making an awkward slide into Brandon Phillips' tag at second. After getting caught stealing, Justin Upton swings his helmet in frustration but loses his grip and accidentally hits Yonder Alonso. After grounding out to the pitcher, a frustrated Bo Jackson treats his bat like a twig and breaks it in two over his helmet. After Athletics pitcher Bobby Witt strikes out Bo Jackson in the bottom of the fifth, Bo breaks his bat over his knee. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. demolishes bat after strikeout. Bo Jackson style bat break. D. Strange Gordon hits Travis Darnond with pitch, hilarity ensues. This may be the most fun hit by pitch you'll ever see. During the 1993 All-Star Game, Randy Johnson's first pitch gets John Kruk's heart palpitating, leading to an easy strikeout, much to the relief of Kruk. Don't talk on your phone during a baseball game. David Ortiz strikes out, then argues with the umpire, smashes the dugout phone with his bat, and is ejected for his display. Toronto Blue Jays Police Foul Ball Fail Let's bring our foul ball fun to an end with this clip of a Toronto Blue Jays police officer failing to gracefully avoid the foul ball that approaches him. At least he laughs about it at the end of the clip. Blue Jays mascot Ace takes a tumble over the wall trying to reel in a foul ball off the bat of Russell Martin.
Todd Frazier ranges near the stands and dives in to make a play on the foul ball, but injures himself and leaves the game. Russell Martin takes a tumble after making a catch. Blue Jays catcher Russell Martin ranges back into foul ground to catch Adubel Herrera's pop-up, then tumbles over some netting near the Phillies' dugout. Hilarious Toronto Blue Jays fail. Not just once, but twice in the same play, and almost a third time with the catcher at third. Ichiro Suzuki makes a gorgeous leaping catch and crashes into the right field wall, robbing David Ortiz of extra bases in the third. Kevin Miller hits a single down the line, then miscalculates his slide at trying for a double and is tagged well short of second base. You're out of there! Baseball pitcher they call The Beard smashes up water cooler after being pulled from ballgame. A frustrated Paul O'Neill, thinking the game is over, kicks the ball to his first baseman and saves the game. Joe Blanton gets his frustration out after a five-run frame by hitting a cooler in the dugout between innings. Guy falls under Tarp being rolled at Royals vs. Mariners game. Groundskeeper lives to laugh about Tarp fiasco. Watch this Royals ground crew member narrowly avoid getting swallowed up by the Tarp after it started raining in Kansas City. David Robertson reacts as Gary Sanchez takes a breather after being hit hard by a foul tip. It was a scary moment for a groundskeeper during the Pittsburgh Pirates game when he was caught in a giant tarp on the baseball field. Even the ball players came to the rescue and leapt into action to wrestle the tarp and free the trapped man. Finally, don't forget to support us by liking the video and subscribing to the channel. And don't forget to turn on notifications to receive all the latest updates. See you in the next video. Goodbye.